A local school district has passed a very important test about the quality of its education. A test that's given by an agency that ranks schools all across the nation. WXVT Steve Dreyer has more local news tonight from Washington County. It's now official. The Greenville School District is officially accredited. What does that mean for your students and what does that mean for the future of the Greenville Public Schools? Dr. Harvey Franklin, superintendent of the Greenville Public School District, explains. Two things it means, first of all. Um, one of the things that it represents is that when a child graduates from this organization, this school district, that that, uh, that the diploma will represent that they are uh, to go to any college across America and sometimes internationally. So that's a very uh, powerful statement to say that when a child graduates from Greenfield Public School District. Another thing that it represents is that it shares with businesses and those uh, individuals who want to move to this community that you have a highly accredited and quality school district in the Greenville public area. Here are a list of schools that have been affected by the process and everything is now under one group, one organization. Individual schools had, were islands of themselves and uh, it was a disconnect. Now SACS accreditation has brought it together as a system to make sure that um, the system thinking uh, the system processes are being developed in all the areas and all the schools too as well. Elation has occurred throughout the district. All the hard work has finally paid off and it doesn't stop there. Teachers must continue to attend workshops and students and staff also must continuously work hard if they are to keep their accreditation. Very, very uh, proud to be accredited, but more importantly, um, one of the things I want to know is um, we're making things happen here in Greenfield Public School District. We have a very quality school district and we want everybody to know that. It won't be for another five years before they go through this all over again. But in the meantime, it's a huge step for the district and a bigger one for the community. Reporting in Greenville, Steve Dreyer, WXVD, Delta News. And the SACS agency will do a follow-up in 10 months. After that, it will be five years before the school district in Greenville will go through the process all over again. One local